Hey ladies and gentlemen, here we have the Škoda Comic in Select. This used to be a style package, so new name. But we can see the base LED headlights. Now uh, let's come a little bit closer and check it out. So we have the, for the data running lights, top LED projectors. We have the new design of the main headlights, also with the LED projectors. Of course, you can go for the upgraded matrix option. You can see here Škoda Crystal Lightning. You can see the fog lights and there is side tunneling here for better aerodynamics. Now we can see the new grille in chrome surrounding. You can see the 3D new design, radar on the top, classical Škoda badge on the front. Parking sensors integrated here and then we can see the new mesh design here on the bottom air intake. And uh, look at this, this is kind of a gray unpainted plastic finish for the lip, kind of gives it a little sporty look as well. Backing up so you can see the new comic facelift and the select trim. Now I'm gonna check the spec later. Now I can see the alloys, so this might be 16 inch. So 205 60 R16 solar alloys. Mirrors, turn signal, auto dimming, foldable and heatable. Parking car holder, two speakers in the dash, light and range sensor, lane assist camera, double glass now for the windshield, silver roof racks, same shark fin antenna, checking the profile of the car. It looks the same. We have the chrome surrounding on the back, tinted rear windows. Now there's a little crowd here, so let me just show you the back. So we have the new LED taillights. So these are the upgraded version. These are not the base, as on the front. With dynamic turn signals, you can see the cat eyes. And you can see the new Škoda, new Sh. In silver, we saw the Monte Carlo package on the channel. Now if I back up. And you can see kind of simple diffuser, little black and gray accents no fake exhaust tips that's nice now white led license plate illumination will wash your nozzle for the back and camera now in this case manual but you can get the electronic opening you can see that opens nice and tall now for closing you have the manual so no button here very generous cargo space now i have a little net here so you can put stuff on the top Flat entry, easy cargo folding inside. So here you have the shelf here. So fold it like this. You can put it like that. So you have extra room here. So there's like five, maybe six, maybe eight or nine fingers to the loading area from here. Now on the right side, you can see there's like this cubby. There's a tether point here, here and there. Six latches, there's a net holder. There's a, put this down, emergency triangle place, grocery hooks on both ends, full outlet. So you have the warm light here on the right. On Scala, it's on the left, here's a blank, but still grocery hooks in for the net. Room for first aid or fire extinguisher, little pocket here on the left. Now, if you pull this one up, so I guess this helps to hold the false floor there and there's a spare wheel still in a Škoda so that's very practical instead of a patching kit. Now you can lower this down so you see you get five six fingers of height to the loading area. Now let's put this back. There we go. Okay manual closing. Better look there. Now, so Škoda now has this in gray, it's not transparent ice scraper anymore, so no labeling for the tire pressure. You have here minimum 95 run, and if you open this, you can put it here. Pretty sure you already know that. Now let me just back up here so you can see the comic. And let's see if we can get to the back seat.
now slightly better closing sound on Scala to be honest but the rear window is down so it doesn't give it justice now you can push here to lock for the kits from the inside hard plastic then we have the textile here big handle speaker there and there all power windows this is all robust kind of narrow pockets here on the front they're wider and you can see the textile seat so we have a little beret and some sort of a maybe copper and gray stitching combo you can see that you can lower this one and you can see the back cargo area now you can see the great roof liner and let's jump inside so a lot of feet room a lot of knee room big pockets here with the textile seats you can see you can extend the front armrest air vents into USB C's so blank here transmission tunnels tall but narrow these are very comfy no armrest there you can put these here so if you're knocking down the seats they're not in the way a lot of light inside all four sides have these and there are little hooks here and on the B pillar light switch we have warm lights it's odd because in Scala there were cold lights closing sound kind of rattles but the front is open headspace for two meter tall person or 6.6 .6 in feet very comfortable CUV so plenty of headroom and let's check the front separate video new superb so you can see keyless entry there's a little plastic you can pop here so there's a physical key cylinder behind that and you have a physical key in your key fob now this opens nice and wide now closing sound with the door excuse me with the window down okay so on the front this is softly padded this flashes red when the car is locked in this case we have the blind spot warning there you can lock the rear for the kids all power windows fully electronic and fully automatic folding heating in reverse right mirror dips down big pockets speaker there you can see for the automatic basic rubber paddles manual seats push that one up to slide back and forward up and down tilt of the top and lumbar support these are classical Skoda seats by now they just change the cloth a little bit so it's not all the same LED light height should keep this an automatic this is just for the car show a little pocket here for maybe garage opener you can see this is closed open and steering column is manually adjusted switching to wireless so here's a familiar point of view zooming back in now we have texture on the steering wheel so it's not too smooth this one's two spoke but nice physical controls you have the heated steering wheel you have the sport paddles for the automatic classical light rain cruise control settings you have a little cloth here and this is in black but the dash is soft speaker in the a pillar so you can see the textile here spacious glove compartment there's no pen holder anymore but it's the same new infotainment but reliable you have the new touch layout and you still have physical controls there so that's quite nice physical buttons for the hazards lock and lock the car and what I love physical AC controls this one came with a heated seats you can see the start stop is in the same spot and you have the digital cockpit that's wider and you can see there's a wireless charger here it's an option with two USB C's DSG new lever driving modes auto start slip off parking sensor still manual handbrake this is rubberized bottom this is to prevent the bottle from spinning and you can unclap it like for example coca-cola bottle and 12 volt outlet this is soft but it can extend it doesn't have levels there's a decent room here there's a carpet underneath 
front seats have the isofix and generally quite comfy nice in the winter warm so let me just switch this one off to not to kill the battery you can see here auto dimming a little basil but it's okay passenger airbag information you saw these glasses compartment this is rubberized emergency call road assistance you can see document holder and privacy mirror and headspace well for two meter tall person plenty of headspace on the front always and that's it that's the just uh, new trim so uh let's get out and check what's underneath the bonnet So this is kind of great finish. Maybe I didn't focus on that detail there. Okay, so push to the left. So inside is the TSI uh, petrol. So they remove the front, uh, excuse me, the top mask, but you really don't need it. And now you get the blue funnel to not spill your washer fluid in the engine compartment. You still have to use the little leg, but you can retrofit the gas ruts. Let it drop closes perfectly. Now let's see the package. So again, comic select, or excuse me, selection. Uh, this is instead of the style, just a new name. And here we can see it's a 1.0 uh, TSI 115 horsepower. In this case, with seven speed automatic DSG. And came here with the 16 inch alloys. So these are the standard options. So USB-C 45 watts, so it's a fast charge. And you have the Android and Apple CarPlay, all the good stuff. Base price 32, almost 33,000 euros. Moon white metallic color. So, oh, this is a metallic color. I just didn't notice, honestly, from the distance. And here's some options with the chrome package and so on. You can take a photo of this, translate with your phone. I'm not gonna pretend like I know Deutsch, although there are some uh, English words like the winter package and so on. Uh, there are 2,000 euros of options, 350 euros, some sort of discount. And in Austria, here in uh, Graz, there's 34,671 euros for the new comic. So the new comic looks fresh. I personally prefer the Scala, but you can see it in the you can see it in the base uh, LED setup. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Bye.